Hey, what's going on guys? James Jam here. Welcome back to a brand new video today. And I know um, it's been definitely been a while since last video. I think I it's probably been at least uh, maybe a week, a week and a half. But um, basically, I guys, I've been so busy the last um, few weeks doing stuff on the server. And also, I've had so much schoolwork. It's insane. Like last weekend, I had, I think, I, I love five different things I had to do. It was absolutely crazy. So seriously, I wanted to get a video out for you guys earlier. I actually really wanted to get one out on Saturday, except I just wasn't able to. So I'm making it today. And um, hopefully, um, I'm going to upload it tonight. So then it will come out to you guys uh, tomorrow morning or obviously whenever you're watching this video but basically today I just want to update you on what's going on, on the server and also <clears throat> kind of why I haven't also been uploading so I think in the last video I made um, I said how I was getting my laptop repaired because there was some problems with the actual fan and, and some stuff inside the laptop but I haven't actually gone to get it repaired yet because it's actually it's working it started working again, but it's not working uh, very well. I just haven't really gone to get a repair because I've needed to. I've I've need I've, been, I've needed to use it to actually do work on. So I am gonna get it repaired soon, except just at the moment um, I haven't uh, got it repaired. And I'll try and make an update video maybe every every uh, few days or so to try and let you know what's going on if I can. But anyway, <clears throat> basically what I'm gonna do in this video, I'm basically just gonna show a bunch of the new things that we've added to the server. So firstly. Um, I'll just show you, I'll just show, show off the new spawn to you. So I don't know if you saw this. This is just like a huge building I made in a spawn. Yeah, I may have showed that in the last video. I'm not too sure. But then if this is, um, this is uh, probably, probably one of the coolest things. If you go out here on the east path, you come down and you've got the, um, server store board just here. This isn't, yeah, this is, this is just moved to this path. And then you come down here and you've got a huge, um, this is actually a, another huge PVP arena just here. I'll show that in a second. But then we got a cool looking volcano just here. Uh, we got a few other awesome things like, um, <clears throat> sorry, I got a bit of a sore throat at the moment. This is still here, but this has been changed up a little bit and now it's lava instead of water. And then we just got a, a few things like over here. We changed up that, like what it looks like and everything. So it looks a lot, a lot better now, I think. So anyway, over here, this is the boss arena. So basically what the boss arena will be, we haven't designed the bosses just yet. Basically, all right, one sec. Okay, sorry about that just there. I did just get a Skype call, but what the boss is, what the boss arena will be, um, every probably every two hours or so on the server, a um, a random boss will actually a random boss selected out of maybe like five or so bosses or maybe a few more will be spawned here, and then it will say in chat a a um, a um, insert boss here. It will basically say in chat what boss is like at the um. At the boss arena and to say like you can go kill it and you can receive rewards and when you kill the boss you will actually receive rewards and things like that and then it'll just have a thing just here that says next boss spawns in so you can actually go check if you do want to but beware pvp is enabled here so people may uh, people may try and kill you and also don't think you can just run out because when you're in combat there'll be last walls around it so pretty much you won't be able to escape until you get out of combat but anyway then over here if we go um Actually, I think that's pretty much the whole spawn. No, if there's one bit down here, I showed this actually in the trailer video, in the trailer video a while ago. It wasn't really a trailer, it was just like a cinematic of the server. I kind of showed this, but this is going to be where the coughs are, and we're going to, which cough is just a uh, king of the hill. So we're going to have like PvP events like coughs, for example, and basically we'll go here, try and fight for the king of the hill, and then the winner will receive a prize and stuff, and of which could be these common rare or treasure shards now what you do with these shards if you read it it says i'll oh, just uh godly godly treasure shards take these shards to the treasure master and spawn to trade them for a ward uh slash treasure mark slash warp treasure master so that's just over there but i'll just go <coughs> slash warp treasure master which maybe we should shorten that i don't know but anyway here's the treasure master and it says the treasure master up ahead so you go up here and um Basically, all you got to do, and it actually says, in place of where the, it would say the crystal's name, it says trade by placing the same items in empty slots. So basically, um, basically the items in there are just uh, color code, and we just got a sign that lets people know that there. I mean, it's pretty obvious it says common crate key, so common, common treasure shard, just put that in there. Boom, trade, you get a common crate key. And then, uh, rare, rare treasure shard, oh, whoop, there we go. I believe, there we go, okay, we got a rare crate key. And then godly, I don't know, sometimes it doesn't work. Please check. 
well, obviously, because we're putting the godly in the rare section. There we go. Alright, I don't know why it took so long. But anyway, we got these crate keys now, <clears throat> and then we can actually go over here, and we got the common rare and godly crate. So basically these, you just... We're definitely going to be adding a lot more prizes in these soon, but I'll just kind of flick through them, see what you can get. And, oh, I did show you these... Uh, these are uh, special foods in the last video, but I do want to show you the mixed elixir and the dragon elixir And there'll probably be more things like this as well. They're really cool And then in the godly crate you've got um, obviously in all these crates you have the ranks and then you've just got a bunch of uh, cool items uh, That god book isn't working at the moment by the way if you're wondering So we're just gonna open these up and we'll just see what we get at the moment There's no percentages for any of the items in here. So it will just give me any random item. We got chocolate chip cookies nice <laughs> They basically just give us speed 4. That's that left there. Probably one of my favorite things. They're awesome. All right, wreck Reiki. Here we go. This, I don't even know why I'm trying to get hyped up. I mean, it's just like it's just to test it out. All right, we got chocolate pants. That's just one of the items you can win. And um, and then we just do the godly crate key if it if it actually goes. And we got a witch spawner. <clears throat> so witch spawner. That's um that's actually pretty good because in the um I'll talk about this a bit later actually. But anyway. If we hop over to the enchant section, which is just over here, we've got um, we've got this whole new thing. So I'll try and explain it. So basically, if you watched the last last server update video, um, we added the custom enchants into the gladiator crate key just here. So you could get uh, you could actually get the custom enchants from a gladiator crate key, which you can buy um, just over here. But now you can also enchant your own items with custom enchants, which which is absolutely awesome. So I I completely love this, uh, love this plugin uh, figures made. So big thank you to Fig for doing this. Seriously, that is, it was absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for the help. But I've still got such a sore throat, so I apologize. But basically, what you do, armor enchantment orb. Right now, I have no XP, so it's not going to do anything. Um, yeah, as you can see, and <laughs> we're still in survival. Or well, we have a little bit, but I have enough. So let's just give ourselves, just for the sake of doing this, let's just give ourselves 500,000 XP. All right. So basically what you would do, you'd right click on one of these enchantment orbs with your with your item. So basically this one you'd right click with armor, this one you'd use a weapon, so a sword or an... I think you may be able to use an axe, but I think it's just a sword actually. And then this one you, do, you, use, a, um, you use a bow. So I'll just do this real quick. With this one we got frozen 3 on there and it'll basically enchant your, your item with a random enchant of a random level. So we got frozen 3... Poison one and oh, we got frozen. Okay, frozen. We got but we got a bunch of enchants on this. Let's just do this. And now the max amount of enchantments you can actually have on one piece um, is five. So after five enchants, you can't get any more enchants. And the max level currently for all the enchantments uh, is level five. Except we're probably going to still be changing up the enchants and stuff like that. So that might that may change. But as you can see here, if we keep right clicking it like this, eventually it will say. You already have the max number of enchants because basically what happens as it goes through the as it goes through the list it go, basically when you click this it goes through a list of enchants and enchants um, and executes a command that will enchant your piece of armor randomly with one of those enchants so if you already have that enchant or the max level of that enchant sorry um, you will um, unfortunately you'll take your XP and you won't get anything but that's that's kind of just part of the risk of actually um, of actually uh, using these things so it kind of makes it kind of makes a little bit of a risk involved to get that those like high tier um high tier uh, pieces of armor and then there's just a warning there just to, you know let people know and then let's just do the weapon enchants you know why not we'll just spam it just get a bunch of enchants and uh, enchants sorry and as you can see there it says in chat you already have the max number of enchants highest level and um there we go that's what we got from uh from about that there we go we upgraded to poison five so you can actually do that um but there's just like like I said, it's just a random chance, so you might uh, might get very unlucky, so it's risky. And then we got the bow um, enchantment orb here, glowing one. Okay, that's a glitch. They shouldn't actually have glowing in the in the bow enchants. I don't know why it does. I need to remove that. Glowing gives you um, night vision. It's meant to be for a helmet. For some reason, it's in the bow enchants. But anyway, we we'll just spam click this. Why not? I really want to get I really want to get blaze on this. So I might actually get another bow just so I can do that. But let me just. Uh, Give Jamesy Jam arrow. Let's just give myself some arrows real quick. And basically, this is what the uh, this is what some of the enchants do. Is so cool. So here, um, the enchant that's actually making lots of different arrows is called Volley. Now there's an enchant called Molotov on this as well. 
and it's meant to make like uh, like a um, a fire kind of like a fire thingy uh, it's hard to explain I'll try and get it to activate but I think you actually need to uh, oh my god I probably almost just killed myself okay I don't think I did but I'm pretty sure for it to activate you have to actually shoot someone so you can't just fire the thing slash heal oh my god I was a half a heart oh my god that was crazy all right GMC Let's just hop back over here, and I really want to get one with Blaze, because I really want to show you this one. So let me just get a um, get another bow, GMS, and of course it's going to shoot every time. Molotov 3, maybe it will um, work? Yeah, no, you have to you have to actually shoot someone with your bow. Wow, we got Molotov a lot. Can we get Blaze? I really want to get Blaze. Alright, never mind. We've already got the max number in chance. Alright, one more time. I just want to... You know what, what we'll do, we'll just um, enchant it with Blaze. Enchant, Blaze 1. Alright, we're going to get another bow. GMC, uh, bow. Alright, I just I really want to show this enchant, because it's really cool. Blaze 1, there we go. Alright, we got Blaze 1, and I'm pretty sure Blaze 1 is actually the max level. Okay, it is. And then if we go, it creates a fireball, and it shoots out, and it's pretty awesome. But, um, uh, yeah, we probably have to turn this um, fire fire spreading stuff off at spawn. Uh, we haven't done that just yet. But yeah, you could just keep kind of shooting this around. And then, yeah, and it actually just shoots like a fireball, which is the coolest thing ever. So I can't, um, I can't wait to actually use that in the server. It's going to be tons, tons, uh, tons of fun. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. Okay, guys, that's going to pretty much wrap up this update video for today. I hope you did enjoy. And um, currently the server is actually whitelisted while we uh, while we work on all the new updates. And then once we finally uh, once we finally finish with it, we will unlike unwhitelist it and make an official release, obviously, or re-release actually. And then we'll, we'll set. We'll, don't worry, we'll inform you guys and we'll have a trailer and everything for that posted on this channel. So make sure to subscribe if you're new, so you do get to see that trailer. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, please leave a like down below, and I'll see you next time. Until then, peace out. <laughs>